here at JTEC at the Diesel Technology Program. Uh, we just got done re-inserting re a wheel bearing. Uh, we put down the, uh, the lock nut and the washers to specifications. I'm putting down the uh, jam nut now to 100 foot-pounds. And then I'm going to show you how to measure uh, uh, measure your input. Give me one second. We have it. Here we have our dial indicator. We use this to, to measure how much the rim will wobble on, on the new bearing that it's sitting on. I'm going to go ahead and wipe my hands off a little bit. All right, it has a magnetic on and off. I have it off right now. I'm going to move this to where I can get to. Stick it to the bearing here. Some people put it on the rim and then go to the bearing. We don't have a smooth, a smooth, flat spot to be able to do that, so we're just going to do it backwards. All right. Lock this in. Ready? Then we zero out. Oh. Whoever used this before me left me with a real mess, but I got it ready now. <laughs> I do that all the time, trying to put it on too tight. All right, finally, I'm gonna zero her out. Put zero on the dial indicator on the needle. And then you shake the wheel back and forth. You want in between one, one one thousand, and five thousand would be a good in play for the bearing that we just installed. Right now it's bouncing. I would say probably two thousand, maybe three, which is perfect. This is ready to put back on the road. Thank you for watching. <laughs>